yeah? Here are some more examples because I wanted to show you that we need do or does or did in present simple or past simple. Did in past simple, do or does in present simple. But so angry did I feel that I burst into a tantrum. Yeah, I had a ten temperature tantrum. So, so angry did I feel. We've got to have that inversion with the auxiliary verb. So angry did I feel. Um, so wonderful, um, so wonderful do I feel that in present tense, or so wonderful does she feel that in present tense, okay? So please be aware that you need an auxiliary verb for this fronted so inversion. Um, it's like questions in English. You need did, do, does in questions in present and past simple. Um, okay, and also you'll often see so much and so little being used at the front as well. And again, it sounds quite formal to me because it's got inversion. So little did we earn that we had to supplement our income. Yeah. Or so much did he know, yet so little did we learn. Yeah. So much did he know, yet so little did he reveal. Did he tell us? Maybe there's an interrogation and you have a suspect and you get the impression he knew a lot, but he didn't say anything. So, so much did he know, yet so little did he reveal. Yeah, something like that. OK, so please be, uh, please keep this in mind. Bear all of these constructions in mind. These fronted constructions sound very clever to me and they sound, well, I think you will get higher marks if you're using some of them in your essays, that kind of thing, simply because it sounds good. It sounds very formal, so only use them in formal academic essays or um, maybe in a story. It sounds very good in literature, so literature, certainly. But even in your speaking, you know, don't just think that this is for writing. I think it's easier in your writing to, to implement them firstly, check that they're correct and then put them into your speaking. But please, if you have any questions about any of these um, constructions, any of these phrases, please put them in the dis discussion in the Q&A and I will answer your questions and I'll see you all in the next class.